Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this one, we're going to be checking out some new LQS items. The limited quantity shops are back, and if you get them, then you will be getting access to a bunch of new badges, which will then, of course, give you access to the items. So the first of which is the White Lotus Aculite, and this is something you can get for the limited quantity packages. First one right here. I have not seen these, so interested to know what this will... Oh, that's nice. I like that. And there is the armor set for that. We get the helms right there. Multiple different styles for it. Very nice helms. And then the cape right there. I like this one. That's a really nice cape. And then a pat the white lotus. Very, very nice psychedelic ears and a white lotus emblem so that's pretty cool that's one of the things that you can get there's two different versions of these one is for acs and then one is for members so gold or the opposite next we have the gold and silver gear let's check this out and the first thing ooh, very nice i like that we've got a another ver oh this is the frost weaver I did not think that was going to be in there, but that is pretty darn cool. Look at this nice gold hammer. I like that. Uh, hammers, uh, hammers, plural. And then you have a pet. Oh man, look at his eyes roll around. The festive imp intruder. And then you have the frost weaver companion. Very nice. Next on the list, I'm gonna, I'm saving this one up. So next is the frost lorn titan. I love this. I already know it. So this right here is the Frostlorn Polar Bear Gift Box. Inside this giant gift box is a hibernating, hi, hibernating, hibernating polar bear. And once it awakes, it'll become the Frostlorn Polar Bear Mount Armor. It's not quite ready yet, so it will be, you can just hold on to that until it gets ready. There we go. Get the first axe right there. And then the axes. We also have an axe with a shield. And then the Frostlorn Titan armor with this beautiful helm or this one. And of course, this is from AQ3D. So those of you who do play AQ3D or at least saw the one that Dej made. So this is the reincarnation of it in AQ Worlds. And they did a wonderful job with it. Really good job. It looks great. The next one is the Primal Frost Tiger. Now, this is one that was available for a while ago, but it did come back for this LQS, and I think it's now out of print. So you can no longer get this. It's now perma rare, but this is a really nice one too. Got two different styles of the things, either the gold or the frost version of the weapons. A lot of, of different weapons to choose from here. So very, very nice one for those. Then you have the armor set, a couple different variant versions of them. Those are very cool. And then you have some helms for it, all of which are pretty neat. The capes right here for different kinds. And then two different pads kind of off the screen here, but you get the idea. The Frozen Draculich Lord, this was a summer 2023 limited thing. It did come back. There were still some available. I don't think there are any more as of the filming of this video, so this is now perma rare. Great armor set, though. I really like this one. Look at that scythe. And that is just gorgeous. And there's two different versions of the armor as well. So you've got that version or that version. And then for the helms, you have two different helms for it and then the wings so yeah it's a really good set very nice set and there's the draculich right there the final one which is the one that i was really hoping to get and actually it didn't matter because i think i would have already got it from the other one but anyways this is gives you this the kelibald of cheer very very awesome and then you get the paragon of joy plate with the helm and the cloak and then you have the folded wings as well as the wings with the... This is a great set and obviously the one that I really like because I love big 
bulky armors. So this was something that I knew I was going to be getting hands down. So I'm just, I'll show you what the whole set looks like in its complete entirety. This is what the armor set looks like. Absolutely gorgeous. Love this armor set. Now you can actually get this armor set if you were at a certain tier. I don't remember what the tier required was in last year's gifting event. If you got up to a certain tier, you would have, basically, if you get up to the tier that has access to the house pet, which is going to, there you go right there. If you have access to this from last year's gifting event, then you also have access to this armor set. You don't even need the LQS. And that is it for this video. What did you guys think of the LQSs? And did you get the items that you were wanting to go for? Or did the shops run out before you got to it? You have to be fast to get it. You got to be right there at the cooldown. I mean, not the cooldown, but at the reset, you need to be right there available. So hopefully you'll get the items you want. Good luck, guys. And thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.